My life is I'm a studio assistant, first of all, and I try to do my photos. Busy life of London, but also I, I prefer to do the photography generally by the river with the blue of the skies when it's, it's lovely reflecting on the river, and uh, and I try to to just catch the second with the maybe the, my favorite light or flower or landscape wherever I'm going, and uh, and I think it's very important to catch that and put it on paper. So every day is different, but you just have to, you can't be lazy, you have to get your, your chance. I like to go, generally go by bicycle, to do all these photos because it's quicker, and you could swing and you could park. And I go out with a bicycle and I went one evening in the South Bank River, in South Bank, and I saw this uh, player uh, with the saxophone and I thought it was so beautiful with the music and I thought I should do a shot. So I told him, look, if you want me to do other photos, you should uh, get in touch with me and I will be available one afternoon and we'll do again. And he was posing for me two hours and from two photos they, they create an album for his CD. <laughs> I document the life of Ken, my husband, as I'm a studio assistant and sometimes I'm, I'm working with him. And uh, so I just, uh, I try to get him while he's working. I'm doing the city when he's painting in the city as well. They like all the normal tourist places. And I think not being born here, you know, I always could see the London as a high of a tourist, how wonderful it is. If you live here all the time, you may get used and you can see the things that somebody from, uh, from abroad could see. In Cornwall, I like the light. Cornwall, I always say, with wonderful weather, Cornwall is the best in the world, you know. And the uh, landscape is very good. So you've got a chance to take uh, photos of lovely flowers. They are there all year around, and the sea, and, uh, and the country together. <laughs> It's quite a wonderful combination. I like to do landscapes in a beautiful light, for example, but also I like to do uh, the people. When I go to Egypt, I could see their um, culture is going to change, and maybe they clothes that are going to change in the future and uh, the, the kind of work that they do for example in the fields they're going to become more uh, technologic one day and I would like to shoot them where they are collecting potatoes for example or they are in um, uh, doing very basic things that I, I'm, I related them 
with my childhood where I was brought up and I wasn't, uh, I wasn't wealthy at all and I was content with little things. I tried to catch a, a piece of history. When I'm going to these uh, countries, for example, it's not because I like to photo photography of the poverty or because I, I try enjoyment by like that. I try enjoyment because I related with them and I remember when I was uh, young, you know, I, I was very close to, to their way of life. I'm traveling generally on my own and I, I've got the chance to get very near to people and they are not shy of me and they are very polite and invited me inside their houses as well so I could do very close shots and uh, I could know them and they, they offer me lunch so I could, I could do all kind of photos very close to their normal life. Venice, for sure, is one of my uh, favorites because of, uh, of the buildings, because of the light. It doesn't matter how many times you go there, you always discover something new. architectural style and all the palace and the churches and the bridges, whatever, I don't know, it's magical. I get very much uh, inspired by the carnival in Venice, you know, that uh, kind of um, party outside in the roads with all these people wearing these wonderful costumes and sometimes they work here to, to build their costume and, uh, and they are there. The people that for one day or two, they, they, you never know what is behind the mask and they feel like stars because they like to show them off to all the photographers with their wonderful costumes. So that's why I think it's just a very short period, maybe 10 days a year and you have to catch it. I do some um, promotion of my work on Facebook, on Twitter, and I like to make these photo books and I like to show to people. I've got some buyers, so I'm very pleased with that. I like to show my work. I, I'm very pleased when I saw some appreciation about from people. I'm doing uh, showing in several, for example, some restaurants in Venice or some coffee shops in London. And um, in November, I will uh, I will have uh, a, a show in the Gallery Cafe at the Sackler Wing at the Royal the Royal Academy, and it will be. A real good chance for me. Uh -huh.